Mike, this all comes down to tomorrow's negotiation. If the teachers union in the district don't come to some sort of agreement regarding salary and health benefits, the teachers here are prepared to walk. Now, earlier today, if you logged on to the school district website, you saw this important message on the main page alerting everyone of the possible strike, saying that if it happens, students won't have class for eight days starting on Wednesday. Parents will be notified by the call system about the decision. Now, there are 191 teachers in this district, and they've been fighting for changes to salary and health benefits since January 2015. A strike is our last resort, not our first option. So what message would you say to the children, the students, and the parents at home? Let's hope we can get things done tomorrow. The superintendent had said tonight was there was progress. Do you agree with that? I would say that's true. I mean, it, it's, it's incremental, but we're coming back tomorrow, and I think people have a desire to try to get it done. Whether we will remains to be seen. Now, if the strike happens, the solicitor says that the administration already has a plan in place for the seniors to be able to complete their coursework and still graduate on time. That information will be released tomorrow again if the strike happens. The negotiations tomorrow start here at 430 and they are expected to last for several hours. Reporting live tonight in Natrona Heights, I'm Kelly Brennan, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.